What's up everybody? Welcome to Kekarat's Pre-Workout Corner. As I will be going over some uh, by requests by some people I actually know in real life. I was kind of wondering what uh, starter supplements they should be taking for uh, those gains. So today I'm going to go over what I like to call my Krillin Level Stack. Which is the kind of the bare bones supplements you should be taking if you're uh, working out. There's also the Namekian level stack which I'll be going over possibly next week which is uh, the intras, the post workouts, um, might not go too much farther than that and then there's my stack which I take a lot of shit to fuel a Saiyan's body so I'm gonna call that the Saiyan level stack and that is more of the uh, kind of the test boosters and uh, the uh, hydro slates I take after I work out keeping my protein synthesis level super high um, I may even drink some uh, branch chain amino acids all day, but I'm not gonna get too much into that stack because that's kind of my uh, kind of my secret stack, my secret stash. So we'll, we'll we'll see if I get into that. So I'm gonna start right now with the Krillin level stack, which you should be taking if you're uh, more likely a beginner. Start with the obvious uh, multivitamin. You definitely want to uh, be taking a multivitamin. That's very important. I like the uh, Nature's Made. It's uh, more natural. It's uh, not synthetic. It's like the other crappy ones. Uh, I think it's a little, uh, it's a little better from what I've read. And it's usually buy one get one free, mix or match. Fish oil. You should be taking fish oil. That's very important for those gains and for your health and for just eyes, your brain, everything. So I take uh, take usually a, a multi in the a.m. and p.m. with the meal. Fish oil you could take with every pre every meal. Uh, I take it about three times a day. So those two bare bones. Next one, I like to go with the uh, protein. This is a little more advanced protein. I had some more extra money this week. Usually I just rock out whey protein. Uh, this is actually the Hexatine SR. It's a six stage protein blend, which will get you the slow, medium, and fast uh, proteins like the uh, micellular caseinites, the uh, whey protein isolates, the egg, the cheaper concentrate. I think there might be uh, uh, the milk, I'm sure, milk protein isolate as well. And this is going to get you uh, kind of a longer blend if you can't get you know your whey shakes every two to three hours. Um, this is pretty good stuff, pretty good taste. Same price as whey protein, but you get about 15 less servings, so that's where they get you. Um, there is next on the agenda is going to be which I was almost going to put this in the Namekian level stack but I'm going to throw it into the Krillin level stack is the pre-workout that is going to get you your creatine monohydrate which I'm going over next which all creatines are not created equal um, this will get you your uh, 100 milligrams of caffeine per scoop so I recommend for uh, your Krillin level starters I recommend one scoop uh, for your Namekian, more advanced people, advanced power levels, I go two scoops, but I'm saying I got three scoops in here, and I do three heaping scoops for that, you know, that false Super Saiyan status. This stuff's pretty good by Skyvation. It's called Psycho. I only bought it because it was 50% off. I have actually, uh, which I'd love to go over in a couple of days. I actually have my own supplement line coming out. It's kind of private selection right now. Um, for lots of very, very good hookups on bulk powders. So I got a amazing supplement uh, supplement stack coming in. I'm calling it the Triple S stack, the Super Saiyan stack. It's got some really good pre-workout, primarily just pre-workout though, with uh, added test boost benefits. It's going to be crazy. It's going to revolutionize the pre-workout industry, but that's only because I made it myself. So here, this one's not bad, but what I don't like about this is you got your creatine monohydrate. What kind of creatine is it, you ask? I don't know. It's probably shitty Chinese creatine. Don't get me wrong. I love Chinese women. I love Chinese food. I love the Chinese, but their creatine's shit. In the industry, we call the Chinese creatine the cheap stuff. It's uh, not very pure. It might have some chemicals in it. You might gain like 10 pounds off it, but you're going to look like a freaking bloated whale from all the water retention. You don't want water retention. And that's primarily any creatine's going to do that. But the cheaper the quality, the more bloat you're going to get. 
task. So, um, which is why I'm doing my own, once again, I'm doing my own supplements by myself now. So that leads me to the creatine. What you want to look for is if you buy creatine, they're all not created equal. There's the people's favorites out there. There's uh, creatine, magnesium, chelate, free alkaline, which is just creatine and baking soda from what I've read. Um, there is a lot of different blends out there, but most likely they're made with, they bond it with really, really cheap, shitty Chinese creatine. But why would you mostly want to get a shitty creatine? I mean, with, if there was like a, off top of my, if there was like a roller coaster that most of the time it derailed and killed everybody, would you really want to ride that roller coaster? Why don't you go on the safer one, which is Creapure. If it does not say it's made with Creapure, it's probably made with shitty Chinese creatine. Creapure is pure. Um, it's really, really good stuff. It's supposed to be the cleanest. Um, that's why I bought this one. This is uh, the only outside factor I'm putting into my own pre-workout, which I'll go over one day. That's Super Saiyan pre-workout. Uh, so Creapure is the way to go. That's the only outside source I'm using because I couldn't find Creapure in bulk. So I trust Optium Nutrition. They're, they're good people. They've been out for a long time. So you can't really see it, but it will say like on the very bottom. Maybe, maybe it'll just, yeah, right there. Made with Creapure. It's exactly what you want. So I take that. Uh, well, this gets you a couple grams. It's prop blended, so you don't know what you're getting, which is another reason I'm doing my own supplement line. Um, so I got this in me right now. This a couple, couple grams of creatine, I assume, because you have to assume. And I will take be taking five grams of this post workout with uh, some uh, oh, whey and casein hydroslates, which I'm not going to get into because that's the Super Saiyan level stack. So um, that's pretty much going to be it for this video. That's the basic Krillin stack. So this stuff's pretty good. I recommend it. But just wait and stay tuned because I got some really good stuff coming. Um, my overall goal definitely would be to do a uh, those AF Ask FMs. I'm not even close to being relevant, but the at, uh, Ask FM, as far as like bodybuilding tr and training and working out and beginners and Dragon Ball, of course, because you know I got 20 plus years under my belt in Dragon Ball. So, an Ask FM, Dragon Ball, and fitness related would be freaking awesome. The only person I could see myself doing that with would be like uh, another workout enthusiast, probably. Uh, Mike from Laughing Stack Media, that'd be kind of cool, but I'm not holding my breath on that. And like I said, I'm not very relevant. I'm just small. Body's not small, that's for sure, but um, it's a very small channel. Try to get out there, so stay tuned for more videos. Um, I may even do some with my with my friend. If you uh, DBO Kakarot and YouTube, you'll see I'm on his channel. We live stream like Nintendo, Sega, Super. He actually just won the Michigan... Um, the Natural Michigan Northern Bodybuilding uh, Tournament, or whatever they call it, bodybuilding, I can't think of the word right now, I'm not going to edit this because I don't care, uh, bodybuilding competition, he actually took he actually took his weight class, which is a uh, light heavyweight, he took his weight class and the overall, so we know what we're talking about, we've been training since we were kids in high school like 10 years ago, so we know what we're talking about, so. Um, look, look, look forward to maybe talk to some people, answer some questions. So until then, stay tuned and you know, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Help out a small little channel. And I will be live streaming Dragon Ball online every single night because that game is still badass. So stay tuned.